CEO Rob Hitler from Creating the Difference. Gonna give you a we're at a ball demo. We're actually at a ball demo where we can actually test out their various companies' bowling balls. I actually want to talk a little bit more about the surface of bowling balls and why that matters so much. I got one of the 900 Global or Global 900s Flux bowling balls. You can see this bowling ball actually is shiny because it's been bowled. Definitely got a lot of surface change on this bowling ball. I'm gonna throw it down the lane just at one time or two, and then I'm gonna change the surface of the bowling ball just to kind of give you a rough idea of how important surface really is when it comes to changing the performance. So that bowling ball obviously did not recover like we would like it to if we were bowling in a tournament right now. I would move around the lane, right? That's one of the options that I could do. I could also change bowling balls, go to something that's stronger, give me a little more hook. In this case, I'm just gonna show you a surface adjustment to be able to change your reaction. So here we go. I got one of the True Cuts sanding pads. I got a 2000 grit pad right here. And the way you would do this is kind of simple, right? You get here, you wanna start by sanding the balls on the sides first, because you can't put as much pressure this way as you can this way, okay? So we're gonna start on the sides of the ball kind of go around lightly pressure around the sides of the ball we're gonna do that actually twice as you can see here we're gonna go around twice and then we're gonna move up to the top to cover the top of the ball all right like so back down to the sides again you see the bowling ball is getting duller like it's supposed to back on the top all right so now we're gonna flip the ball over do the other same, same thing. And what we're doing is by altering the surface, we're gonna make this bowling ball much more aggressive. And then on the top. And this is something you can do before or after bowling. Uh, you can do it in practice. You cannot do it, obviously, during competition. The rules no longer say you cannot do that. You cannot alter the surface, which is what we're doing during competition. But in practice, at home, if you knew you were gonna bowl in this house, get your bowling ball ready. Now look, the True Cut sanding pad obviously has the dust, and the dust has somewhere to go on the pad, which makes it special. You can take that, right? And we could hit it like so right here. And then the pad's clean. The pad's clean and ready to be used again. That's one of the benefits of the True Cut sanding pad. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wipe this bowling ball off real quick to get rid of the dust, and then we're gonna throw it down the lane again. going to wipe the dust off so you can kind of see what the ball looks like. So the ball's now obviously got some more surface. We'll be able to throw it down the lane again and see the performance change. A lot more performance. Obviously that's what you would expect to be able to get when you change the surface of your ball. Now, that was too much, we could go the other way and use some of the True Cut and Apply Polish powered by Turtle Wax to tone that down to get that bowling ball to be right where we want it to be at. Just a little bit less than that and a little bit more than where we were before. Or you could change the grit. We use a 2000 grit, we could move up in grit to the P5000D pad or 3000 grit to give us a little bit more length before we made that aggressive hook. Anyway, as always, if you have more questions or need more information, you can check us out at ctdbowling.com. Ronald Hicklin, CEO from Creative Difference. Have a great day.